Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. So today we're going to be talking about um, the Fortnite storyline of Chapter 2 and what it's at now. So, current date I think is the 9th of August. I'm starting to lose track. Yeah, it's the 9th because I come off holiday yesterday, which was the 8th, so it's the 9th. The logic behind it. But anyway, today we're going to talk about the Chapter 2 storyline. So we dropped in at chapter two, um, not knowing anything, and we discovered that there was a new map, and there was a war going on between Ego and Alter, and these went at war with outposts and stuff like that throughout the whole map, throughout the whole season, there was destruction, um, loading screens hinted towards other things, for example, the Chaos Agent. Um, was found to be the leader of Alter, I believe it is, um, and he owned Steamy Snacks, and he was creating um, some red, a red, um, what's it called, sludge thing army, I can't remember his name, Ripley, red, red Ripley army, and one, and that was at Steamy Stacks, whereas one Ripley was um, formed in Steamy Stacks, and he was like the good version of the red evil Ripley's that was created by this Chaos Agent. So the Chaos Agent was the villain. And that went across the whole map. And Ego um, found Ripley and brought him in and made them his their friends, kind of like their family. And they brought him in. So then you had the Ego and Alter. So we found out Alter was what we thought was the villains and Ego. Ego was the good guys. And then chapter 2, season 2 came around. And we found out that the war had moved on further. To the fact that it removed all the outposts. And we literally got full on locations. Like the agency. The yacht. The shark. The rig. And. The box factory. And. You know, these locations became the mythic POIs. And it's not just because they were mythic weapons, it's because they actually linked in with the storyline. For example, Alter and Ego became Shadow and Ghost. So Ego became Ghost, Alter became Shadow. And the Chaos Agent was, um, like, the one leader, and then Midas was the second. And Midas owned the agency, which was the centre point. And it looked like, it, well, at the very start of the se chapter 2, season 2, it looked like Sha um, Ghost was the leaders. They owned the map, basically. They controlled everything. They won the war of season 1, and they took over um, the agency. Um, and up until that point, it was going well. For Ghost. But then they lost power over the rig. And you know, the rig exploded, and um Tina, Tina Tina, then became part of Shadow. So she then left Ghost along with the henchman and became Shadow. So then that was the first step that Ghost actually lost, was or was losing. And then the same thing happened to the grotto. And so that became a shadow location. And Brutus, again, along with the henchmen, became part of Shadow. So then they started losing. And then towards the end of the season, we saw a picture of Midas and a device, known then as what we were thought were to be the Doomsday device. And we didn't know what this was doing to do, other than the fact we had a, a teaser saying defy the storm. And this then later became the description of Cyclone, which is the suit that was used to actually control a storm in the end event. But we'll move on to that later. So to create, we think, from loading screens, that Jaws from this season, we'll move on to her later, actually created the um, Cyclone suit. And at the time, all we knew to her as was as the engineer. And we thought that it was the daughter or sister or whatever of Midas. And she was part of Ghost. 
However, the doomsday device failed. The storm. He then it was. We then found out that the doomsday device was actually to send them up because the Fortnite map is a loop. It's a simulation, and Midas found out, and he wanted to leave. So the simulation was getting understanding. Um, so when we get new things or new POIs, it's actually part of the simulation. So people never actually die, which was found out by Midas turning characters to gold. But those Then those characters came back to life, meaning they had restarted over the simulation, but didn't know what had happened, which is then why we drop into the um, Fortnite map over and over again, because it is a simulation. However, Midas and Jules found out, and then they wanted to leave. So they got a slight leave, and then Agent Jonesy found out. And he was like, wait, how are you here? Can you hear me? And then we got taken back, and, they, and the people up above, which, like Agent Jonesy, are actually the creators of the simulation. And, you know, this means that they know who Midas is. So they sent him back. However, along with that, they brought a new storm to try and destroy the device so that um, they can't get taken back up because that was dangerous because the simulation became reality. So he got taken out the loop. And then, over time, and then when we got back, we found out that the device actually exploded and Shadow actually took over the agency. And... For a while, it looked like Midas had joined Shadow because he was still at the agency but had Shadow henchmen. So we believe that he had actually joined the agency. Bear in mind at this point, Meowsaws had been kicked off the yacht, taken over by Deadpool, and was put into the box factory and joined Shadow as well. So at that that means that over at Ghost, every single... Um, Boss, except Sky, had actually left the Ghost, from what we believe, and had joined Shadow. However, come Season 3, we got the new wave of people and storyline. And we last saw Midas getting what we thought is eaten by a shark in the um, Season 3 trailer. However, one thing you have to remember is that these trailers, this season, are not actually storyline true. You see, back in season one, for example, we had Ripley, and Ripley was came down in the plane along with um, the rest of Ego. So that means that, well, you know, he would have been alive. However, we now know, we knew after that, that Ripley was actually formed from Slurpy Swamps, which means he could not have gone down through the plane. And the reason they put him onto that plane was to actually sell out the battle pass and to um, do some advertising of the fact that Ripley is a skin in the season. So that could mean that, well, Midas did not get eaten by that shark. It is not storyline related. It was just to show the fact that Midas is no longer on the map and there are sharks, which, you know, that could be a pretty good thing. So this does not mean that Midas is gone from the map. It could mean that Midas is somewhere in the map. And that could actually stand a good chance. You see, up until about two week, two or three weeks ago, we actually had a boat called No Sweat Insurance. And that's now been removed. But on that boat was Midas' chair. And that means that you know, that was either an Easter egg to last season, which they wouldn't do so early on, or Midas is alive and that can't... And that was actually put in insurance to be transported to wherever he is now. However, that chair is not on the map at the moment. So that leads us to believe that Midas will be returning in a future season. Perhaps not this season or next season, but maybe the season after that or even later seasons. So um, Midas, I believe, will return. However, Jules is actually part of Shadow, which means that she was actually a double agent for Midas because Midas was part of Ghost when she made the um, Cyclone suit, which means that she was part of Ghost and Shadow, 
Maybe she left Ghost when Midas left Ghost and joined Shadow. But we don't know for certain. We now have um, Kit, who is the son or daughter of Meow, so as we believe son, but we haven't actually had um, proper you know, um, conf confirmation on that. But that's the son of Meowsles, and the henchmen there and Kit are neutral, which means that Meowsles left both Ghost and Shadow, and they're now living together in their little area down there, which the henchmen could just be for protection between Ghost and Shadow, trying to get them to join each one, because they don't want to be part of the war anymore, they just want to be left alone in their factory. So that could be why that is. Also, we have um, we have Jules, Kit, and Ocean. Now, Ocean is actually part of Ghost, which means that well, we have the three locations: we have a Ghost location, a Shadow location, and a Neutral location. So that means that something will go down because. We know that the war is still going on between Alter and Ego, now known as Ghost vs. Shagger. So will Midas show up somewhere in the future? We don't know. We don't know for certain whether or not he was actually eaten by a shark, or whether he was taken away from the simulation and removed. That is also a slight possibility, because they don't know that Jules helped. Because they didn't know that the device was being made by Midas, as no, as shown, as he was shocked that Midas was there, because he didn't know about it. So now we have the question, what was Lynx doing? Because we saw in the Lynx's loading screen a picture of Meowsles, and we saw Lynx again in Season 2, but it's gone dark. And we didn't see a new variant of Lynx at all. No, it's basically just been just teasers, really, of season seven. So is she going to return in a future season? Maybe in season four? We don't know. But anyway, that is it for this video. So I've now explained the current seasons. I'll do two, a couple more videos on these. I'll do a chapter one storyline. A chapter 1 and chapter 2 storyline linking video where I explain all the links we've seen. And I will also do a theory video where I'll make up some theories that what could happen with the storyline come future seasons. Now whether or not I'll upload that or make that before season 4 or not is another question. Because season 4 is releasing on the 28th of August I believe. If there's no delays, which with Fortnite there probably is. But yeah, that is you know, what is going down. So if you have enjoyed, drop a like, subscribe, all that good stuff. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you guys for watching. Goodbye.